A battle as old as fishing itself, today we're going to show you a knot tying face off between two legendary knots, the mighty Palomar knot versus the trusty Trilee knot. The first Knot Wars battle has an unbelievable ending that we would have never predicted. First, let's introduce our contenders. In one corner, we have the Palomar Knot, renowned for its simplicity and strength. And in the other corner, we have the Trilene Knot, famous for its reliability and versatility. Now, the setup. For this epic battle, we created a patent-pending, high-tech, Knot Strength Tester 5000. Because who doesn't like DIY shows. We used Berkeley Trilene 25 pound monofilament fishing line. We finished prepping by tying Trilene knots on the one side and Palomar knots on the other. And here's a pro tip for all you knot enthusiasts. Make sure to moisten the line before pulling it tight to reduce friction and prevent damage. All right, it's showtime. Let's see which knot can withstand the most pressure. Place your bets. Our first attempt left us scratching our heads. When we applied pressure to the line, our steel leader broke. Look, the steel leader failed. That's ridiculous. Now it makes sense why the steel felt so inadequate at the superhero convention. It couldn't steal the show with its strength compared to all those superheroes. But I guess our fishing line would feel the same way at a knot convention. So anyway, we set it up again for one more attempt. Okay, let's go. Ready for the moment of truth? And three, two, one. Oh, hey! What? Wow, the line broke again. Oh, we couldn't believe what happened. This is insane. Would you look at that? The fishing line couldn't handle the power of these knots. The Palomar and the Trilene knots are both so strong that the line itself gave up packed its bags, caught a flight to the Caribbean, and was so embarrassed it never came back. But after two failures, we had to call it a day. And our knot tying showdown ended with a draw. The real loser here, our poor defeated fishing line. Remember, it's not always just about the knots. Sometimes you need a stronger line to reel in those trophy catches. We're gonna revisit this battle in our next Knot Wars video, after we get some stronger line, of course. So I wanna thank everybody for watching this video, and if you found it interesting, leave us a comment down below and if you're interested in seeing more epic knot battles fishing videos and beginner friendly how-to's like this video and subscribe to the channel for more